Ahora yo estaba pensando que en el que es el chistado, I was actually at this conference here, you know, I just finished a partnership policy and I wanted to do more because as a partner, I knew there was something more, but I just didn't know what. And I came down to this conference here and I saw Betty Williams and I kept wondering what she did and what kind of organization is she? Um, I met with her, I talked to Jockey's Nims and a few more of the others, and they invited me to the board, the um, statewide meeting in that next January. And I went and enjoyed it, and I it just started going from there. I started, I got involved in there, and next thing I knew, I was on the board, I was the regional rep for my my region and then I did a little bit of this and then about two years later Douglas passed away and they promoted me up as Zeiss. Well I was Zeiss pretty and then things did start going. We started going around the state, going to DC, going to places, talking to people. Let people know that we got that we got that they have a right to live their life just like anyone else. It may be a challenge, but that, but that is your right. If you want everybody in the community, why can't you? I mean, you should be able to do anything on this if you want to. From that, I went from, I jumped from that to being president. And now I, I consider myself as a leader. Uh, on top of doing that, I come to work with the art. Getting us all talk, talking to Mr. John Dickerson because at the job that I was at previous, I just didn't like it. I just didn't. I was tired of who got there. So I told them I want to leave. They got that, they give me that position and I've been there ever since. I, I can see myself changing. I think about a lot of times where I came from and how I started. When I started, at Goodwill and worked my way up. And the people that was at Goodwill, they didn't understand. They didn't know what they were doing. They was just had a place there for people to work and give them a couple dollars. But that wasn't me. And I remember when I left Goodwill, I went to Myers. I was there. I remember a person asking me one day, Melanie, is this the kind of job you want? I go, no. I go, I want a career. I couldn't see myself making a career standing back in somebody's coffee. That's one of the kids. This that I have now, I feel like it's led me to be able to grow, to talk to people with disabilities, to let them know. Because, I mean, we go around the state, me and Betty Bo, and we talk to people. A lot of people will say, but well, I didn't know I had that opportunity. I didn't know the opportunity was given to me. Yes, it's given to you. It's given to you as a person with a disability. You may have to have a staff person or a helper, but if you can live that life, why not? Why not go on and do it? Let people know the opportunity is there. Just open the door and take it. For years I was told, you can't do this. Uh, somebody got to lead you. No one leaves me. I get up, I go, I get dressed. I have a husband, we just celebrated eight years of marriage. But it's me. I mean, I'm not going to tell you that I can go ahead and drive a car. No. I, there is a couple of things that I need help on. But for the biggest stuff in my life, I'm my own advocacy. And my aunt and my husband will tell you, don't try to stop me or come out and don't. Mel is living. I've been living the life. We were just staying the other night, me, my husband and I. I'm living that life that I want to. I'm able to enjoy life, traveling and going and doing things and visiting and talking to people and let people know that you got that, you got that life. I'm doing things in my life now that if you would have told me in my 20s, I'd be like, what? Are you serious? Because I had never went nowhere. Been on, I had been on a plane, but not like this. And now we're traveling to 
there's like places of the world and different parts of the, of the state and all over the world. And it's fun. I mean, I, the, the, the administrator says, let's get, she's right there, come on now, let's go here, let's go there. The girl that left before her, Rebecca, Rebecca the same way, she kept me and Betty running. And I mean, we, we don't get tired. My husband was like, Mel, you get to go, yeah. He said, well, as long as you're okay, call me when you get there, and you'll be okay. And it is, it's okay, it really is. So yeah, I have come a long way, and I'm looking forward to not stopping. Just continue to go even more, more and more and more, because I enjoy what I do.